Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, new details have come out about what went down at the Teen Mom Retreat. The very first night, the girls ended up having to be separated. Brianna, Brittany, and Jade, they had to be taken to a different hotel because they were fighting with Ashley. And we know this because Roxanne, she jumped on her IG Live to go off on the Teen Mom producers, basically blaming them for the situation. So we're gonna talk about that. Also, we know that more Teen Mom cast members from the other shows will be dropping in uh, this week on this spinoff. So we have more names of people that will join this show. Um, so yeah, we're gonna get right into it, you guys. Also, I do need to just let you guys know that it's very noisy outside due to the gym. They are almost done. They're so close to being done. So hopefully I can stop warning you guys about the background noise very soon because they are almost done. They've almost got the gym complete. But I just want to let you guys know if you hear a loud noise, that's what it is. So, um, the team mom... Or a train. It's either construction on the gym or train. Okay, so according to the Ashley, they have continued to film the Teen Mom Retreat spinoff this week, despite the big blowout that happened this past Tuesday. Um, the Ashley also says that she has more exclusive details about what went down that night and what has happened since the fight broke out or the, um, the verbal altercation. Because as far as we know, nothing got physical. I'm sure it's probably close to physical, but it did not get physical. Now, Roxanne DeJesus, she was the first to tell us about the fight. She jumped on her IG uh, live and she did this live talking about the altercation and what went down that night. She says she did not know who started the fight, but the Ashley says that her source has filled her in on what started the fight and what's happened afterwards. So according to the source, the first night was actually supposed to be the girls just hanging out. The producers hoped that by putting the girls in there that had problems in the past, that they would make amends. That's what they wanted them to do. Now, Ashley and Jade, they have had problems since 2019. So they put them there purposely. And according to production, they had hopes that they would make amends. Now, others may believe that they had hoped there would be an altercation because that would make for great TV to have, you know, arguing and drama. It will really make for good TV. So whatever you want to believe, that's on you. But I'm going to go with, I believe they put them there hoping for drama. Their story is they put them together hoping to um, fix their relationship, hoping that the two girls would talk it out. So according to the source, um, they was hoping that Ashley would make up with Jade, but Ashley refused to apologize to Jade and that ticked Jade off big time. That's when Jade went off on Ashley and because Brianna is close to Jade, she was backing Jade up and then Ashley started in on both of them. So we got to keep in mind that Brittany and Brianna, they're already going to be on Jade's side because they're close to her from her surgery. She stayed with them for a while and then Jade had a friend there as well. So there was four girls and then Ashley, right? So it says that Jade, Brianna, and Brittany, as well as Jade's friend, they were all moved to a separate location where they still were as of Thursday morning. They were not fired from the spinoff show, despite what some outlets are reporting. I saw that. I saw an article about it, something about them being fired. And I was like, what? Are you kidding me? Like they already fired them. That is not true. According to the Ashley, her source has told her they are still a part of the spinoff show. Ashley did later deny that she attacked the DeJesus girls or Jade, stating instead that she was ganged up on. So after Roxanne put out her IG live, telling everyone about what happened and kind of placing the blame on Ashley, 
Ashley posted on her IG saying, just to be very clear, I did not attack anyone. I was ganged up on and people tried to get physical with me, not the other way around. She also reminded everyone that there were cameras there and that it would play out on TV and someone would look like a liar. If that is the case, you know, it's definitely going to play out in her favor. If when the show comes out, if we see that it was not her, it was them. Then I, we know that Roxanne, we, she really didn't have any details anyways because she said that. She's like, I don't know the details. All I know was some sort of altercation took place and my kids were removed. I think that was more her, her issue was like not even who was at fault was the fact that they removed her kids again. Um, because she felt like this was the second time that her kids were made to like get away from the scene and the situation rather than everyone being removed or the other party being removed. It was just her daughter. So that's what she has a problem with, I do believe. Now the rest of the cast members continue to reside at the original location in San Diego County. And the Ashley can exclusively reveal that additional Team Mom OG cast members have joined the retreat and that is Macy Bookout and Gary Shirley. So yes, you guys, right now in the San Diego County hotel where they are filming this retreat. They have Ashley Siren, they have Amber Portwood, Macy Bookout, and Gary Shirley. They are there and then another location where they are also filming these girls. They have Brittany, Brianna, Jade, and Jade's friend. Also, we know that Bar Smith as well as Devon Austin, they will be joining the retreat festivities at some point in time as well. And the Team Mom YMP girls, they are set to arrive at the retreat later this week or early next week. That being Kayla Sessler, Kaya Elliott, and then Brianna Jeremillo. I'm not really sure how you say her last name, so I usually avoid doing that. But I want to make sure you guys, you know, there's two Briannas that will be working on this show right now. So, um, Brianna and Brittany, the Jesus, they're in another location, Brianna Jeremillo from Team on YMP. She is set to arrive sometime this week. Now it says that the way this is worked out, they're not all staying in one big house. They are at a hotel and everyone has their own room. So it's not like a challenge or a Jersey Shore where they're all together constantly. They do have their own space where they come together for certain activities like hanging out by the pool or doing uh, the sound therapy situation. So they come together at different points, but at the end of the night, they can go back to their own room. Now, I do wonder how Christina feels about this because we know that Gary Shirley is there and so is Amber Portwood. Despite the fact, like we know they're not living in the house together. They're in a hotel and they have their own rooms. But you guys remember, it was just like six months ago or so that Amber, like, accused Gary of hitting on her and like trying to cuddle with her and she went on her IG live like saying that um so Christina like I gotta give it to you you're like you're more of a woman than I am because if if I was told something like that about my man and then he was offered the opportunity to go film a show in a hotel with his ex who just threw those accusations out there I'm like ah no 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 not happening you're gonna stay at home either I'm coming with you or you're staying at home but from what we know, it's just Gary Shirley. I've not heard anything about Christina being there. And the Ashley has not said that Christina is there either. So Gary Shirley is there. Amber Portwood is there. And they're all staying in a hotel in their own rooms. Now, the Ashley did say that there will be much more info to come. And when she puts it out, I will be sure to put it out to you guys. So if you guys are interested in following what's going on at the filming of the Team Mom spinoff, this retreat, situation they have going on make sure you are subscribed to this channel also if you like all things reality television news and gossip for reality tv celebrities make sure you are subscribed to my channel also make sure you give this video a thumbs up and until next time i'll see you guys later goodbye everyone